Hi, I'm Caleb, this is Avner and William. First topic we're gonna be talking about, who's better, Kobe or Steph Curry? Uh, I've gotta say Steph Curry. I think he uh, he's a better outside shooter. He uh, scores Kobe. more average points. And I think he was just better than Kobe. I think I agree with him because Kobe, Kobe's selfish with the ball. He, in his last game, he he didn't have a very good average of makes and shooting. So, but Curry does, isn't a ball hog. Well, I agree with you that he's kind of a ball hog. But this is Kobe Bryant that we're talking about. He's one of the most greatest players of all time. Steph Curry, he might not be in the top 20 even because he, so you have to be a good defensive player and offensive player. Kobe is good at both of those. He's and definitely Kobe, in the top 20. Stephen Curry? Yes, yeah. my head's so small. He might be in the top 20, but not the top 15, probably. Do you think that? No, I think he's in really? the top 10. You think the top 10? At the best, top five. Really? Yeah, maybe. Well, yeah. He's still What's young. What's the list? What's the list? What's like, your list? Uh, probably first would be uh, um, Magic Johnson, maybe. First is Magic no, Johnson? No, no, not first. Like, he's Dr. like fourth. Or, Dr. J. Um, Stephen Curry is fourth. Stephen Curry is not for fourth. I'm talking about... Uh, 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 Magic Johnson. Okay. Dr. Stuff like Dr. J. <laughs> Where would you put Steph on that list? I'd put him at around seven. Okay. Right next. Next topic. We're gonna be talking about if who's better, Ronaldo or Messi. Messi. Messi definitely. Messi. Why? Because he passes the ball. He's aware of his teammates, and he celebrates with his team when another teammate scores. I really know nothing about soccer, so I can't answer that one. <laughs> um, Ronaldo, because Messi, there was like a meeting where he was supposed to sign 300 autographs, but he never came. But you Ronaldo, don't know what you don't know. <laughs> how do you how, know that? <laughs> because he was on the news, but like you don't know what why he skipped it. He could have been sick. He might have had yeah. Sick. You could he could have had a family they crisis. They never told you us don't, that. Yeah. yeah, they never told us why. He missed it. There could have. There's no, probably. He was, a, like, he was about a mile away, and then he just decided not to go. How do you know that? Because they they can see his car. How, like, how do they no, know his, what the his news, car looks like? The news, like you can't just. News? Why would they be looking a mile away? No. Yeah. <laughs> why would they? Yeah. Why be would, looking a mile Why would away? they be looking a mile away from yeah. where the autographs are supposed to happen? Well, they want to know how far he is and when he's gonna get there. Well, if if he was if he was there if he wasn't there and like an hour later he's not gonna show up. They're yeah. not. They won't just. Look, they might just come to his front door and knock. Say, hey, Messi, you in there? But how do they know where his house is? <laughs> maybe it's on the internet. Um, a lot maybe. of things are on the internet. But Ronaldo also didn't celebrate um, at, versus Mexico every time they scored. But Messi's a little more selfish than Ronaldo. No. Okay. I forgot the next one. Which one? What is it? What is it? It's the okay, rookie. I mean, oh, yeah. just rec rookie of the year. Just rookie. next, we're going to talk about who is who's, the who should offen no, who who's should. the who should have been the rookie of the year for the NFL last year. I'm gonna say um, uh, Anthony Brown because I think he was a sixth round pick and I. Uh, and I think he did, he's doing really good for a sixth round pick. I think Dak Prescott because I don't think it was Zeke because if Dak wasn't there, Zeke wouldn't have wouldn't have scored any touchdowns. He wouldn't have made great plays. He because Dak gave him the ball every time. Zeke was supposed to go, and Dak was just the sub for Romo. But Romo got hurt, so he got, he went in. I agree with him. I go with Dak Prescott because Dak Prescott can do a lot more things than Ezekiel Elliott. He can pass. He can run. He can do anything with the ball he wants. Yeah, but 
uh, when you said uh, any quarterback can really run the ball to any running back. Like, you don't need throwing accuracy to hand the ball off. So, like, any quarterback could have given Zeke the ball and he could have scored. And Dak came in half, like, almost half through the season, and he got the Offensive Rookie of the Year. That's kind of impressive. It was, a, li- it impressive. was a, li- it was be- a little before the uh, half, yeah, half yeah. but it was, like... Close to the half. Close to the half and point. And that's all we have. That's it. I'm Caleb. This is William and Aver. See you next time. Peace out.